All right, guys, welcome back for part five of our Dead Space playthrough. We left off right here next to this, uh, this workbench. We are at a point in the game where Isaac is starting to lose his mind more and more. Hallucinations are starting to happen a little more often, hearing voices a little more often. And where we left off specifically, we're clearing out the right side of the area with all the uh, the poisonous people and the 10 kiloton mass of whatever the hell this stuff is. <laughs> but with that said, let's go ahead and get started. Now we have a lot of people laying around here. We killed this thing at the very end of the last video. So we got that taken care of. Let's go ahead and open up this door and see what's inside. Oh my. Well, that worked out nice, didn't it? That worked out well. Just took that guy's head clean off. What a good start to the day. What a good start to the day. Anyways, I hope you guys have been enjoying this video series of Dead Space 1. It's been a great time playing this game again. Oh my God, I just spun so fast. Oh, I've, I've been having a great time playing this game again. It's been years since I last played it. I'm very happy to be here playing it now. Let's go ahead and open up this door. Oh, no power nodes. You know what? I'm gonna, I have money. I'm gonna go buy power node and come back. But yes, I hope you guys have been enjoying this playthrough so far. I have been, and I, I, I feel really great having so many cool people tell me how much they're enjoying the video. So thank you so much for hanging out with me. Check it out Dead Space 1 again before the remake comes out in January of next year. And of course, thank you for leaving likes on the stream. It's great having you guys and all of your support. It means a heck of a lot. Let's buy that power node. Let's go open that door, shall we? Did I clear everything in this room? I feel like I just kind of absentmindedly looked it over. Okay, yeah, it was just that guy. Here we got some credits that pays for half of it. And force energy and line racks. Okay. So we got 6,800 credits. Covers two thirds of the cost of that, plus some ammo and stuff. So that's cool. I'll take it. I'm not sure how many instances in this game where you buy a uh, power node, it actually pays off, but trying to open up as many as I can as I see them. Alright. Yes, yeah, it's looking a little hopeless. There's those voices. Yeah, it's looking a little hopeless in here. Oh, good. It's a big guy, isn't it? It sure is. Cute. Oh, hey, you dropped the power node. Thanks, dude. What a nice guy. What a nice guy. Okay, so this actually took his arm clean off, right? It, right as he was about to hit me, it took what, five, six shots to knock the arm off? That was pretty good. That was pretty good. I'm glad that I remembered it was on number three as well. So that power node has already been covered. So everything else that we just got was completely profit. Okay, I hear one of those things right up above. Yeah, because that's it right there. 
What was that? Is there something in here with me? No? <laughs> I'm a little freaked out by that noise. It sounded like there was a necromorph right next to me. It right, wants me to go in this room. Okay, Isaac. Isaac, you got it. You got to swing down, man. Isaac's not a fighter. He's not good at swinging the fist down. Oops. All right, there we go. All right, now that we killed that, I do expect there to be some enemies out here. Right, wants me to go up that way. Let's check out this room first. Hold on. Thank you. This game's got me paranoid right now. Okay. I guess I'm rightfully paranoid. Alright, we already opened that. I think we're good to go up then. Let me check this. This is where we came out, right? Wait, that body's gone now? Oh no, it's in the other area. Okay. Alright, let's go upstairs. See that about the feeding system. What's this? Replacing nutrient right. Oh. Replacing nutrient right. Alright, I see what I gotta do. Replacing nutrient right. Alright, we got that one. So the one I thought I was hearing was up there. But there is, there is another one up there, of course, but I didn't realize there was one right below me as well. I guess that's what I was hearing. Well, I'm glad I figured that out. Don't you love when you actually figure out what you're supposed to do? Isn't that nice? Hey, it wants me to go up further, but let's check this floor out first. Hydroponic log, Dr. Cross reporting. Something huge just slammed into the hole near food storage. It wasn't a rogue asteroid. I know what that sounds like, but it was big and heavy. I'll report again when I know more. Oh boy. Hey, a power node. Nice. I am an enjoyer of power nodes. Thank you. All right, is this a save station here? We may as well hit it real fast. May as well. Ah, I really don't like that my sensitivity changes whenever I'm stepping on this fleshy stuff. Uh, I don't need that. I have so much force energy ammo. Maybe we should start using some of that. Yeah, let's 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 burn some of that. We've got it. May as well. Oh my! I can't hit it.
Okay. All right. Um, another jump scare. Yikes. I was not expecting that. Holy hell. I don't even, I don't even remember what the heck I was talking about. All right. Nice. This is Temple, acting chief engineer. I came down here to find Dr. Elizabeth Cross, but she's not here. In fact, I can't find anyone. Just more of this organic shit everywhere. I'm going to check the mining deck. It's about the only place I haven't looked yet. I don't even know I'm supposed to be here yet. I feel like I feel like I'm going to be led to come like come this way after I take care of the other things. Let's do that first. Let's go do that first. Dude, I'm getting ahead of myself now. Holy hell, that scared me, man. I was like, hey, what the, is this? Oh, yeah, let's talk about the force gun here and what a bad time it was to switch away from that at that moment, huh? What a bad time that was. <laughs> Good God, dude. Hey, bud. Air hurts. Air hurts, man. All right, we got that guy. I'm pretty sure he wants me to go to level two now. Yeah, okay, I thought so. Yeah, oh, oh, something I, I don't like is how much it changes my sensitivity. It just, it feels so wonky. I, I, I'm just not really into it when, when games change the way your controls feel. Kind of like when games, like, put reverse controls on you. I never like that. <laughs> Entering zero gravity. Zero gravity. Right, I don't think this force gun's gonna work in this area, so let's turn that off for now. Just too far away. Thank you. Thank you, sirs. Very kind. All right, here, another one of these breathers. to restart the oxygen recycling. Once the air's clean, you can get into food storage. Isaac, I've been reading these reports. The crew all began having mass hallucinations. And, well, I just saw my brother on a security monitor. 
I know what you mean. I know what you mean. Navigate my way over here again. Which way is up, man? Exiting zero gravity. All right, hit the stasis recharge. Thank you very much. Top off the old health bar. Thank you very much. Go back to the force gun. Thank you very much. Hopefully no more space tentacles. Thank you very much. All right, we're going to hit this save spot again, just because we completed all that. May as well save so we don't have to worry about it again. Not expecting anything to go wrong, but it is a horror game after all, so, you know. Okay. Should be able to go back to the main room and go on from there. Hello. Oh, damn it. That's not how I wanted it to go down, but that's what happened. So it is what it is, I guess. What I wanted to happen there was just kind of blast them all with one shot, but then the one grabbed me. Command grab attacks, man. Not into it. Oh, we have a lot of line racks as well, so we'll have to burn through some of those soon too. Oh my sensitivity. You help me. Have you seen what's going on out here lately? You help me, man. Flushing all air vents. Restoring nitrogen and oxygen levels. Food storage lockdown lifted. Hell yeah. I'm waiting for something else to happen. Are we good? I guess we're good. All right, wants me to go that way. First, let me hit this store. Sell off the conductor thing. Uh, let me think. We got 42,000 credits. Not sure how much the next suit's going to cost. So I don't want to buy anything yet. <laughs> as much as I kind of want to buy a power node. We're doing good on health packs. We got a lot of line racks here. I think I'm going to store one of my flame fuels. I'll also store a, a force energy. Why not? I think we're doing fine. How are we looking? Yeah, we're looking good. Then now we can use the line rack for a while, or the line gun rather. Hydroponics 
Kellogg, this is Dr. Cross. It's hard for me to believe what I'm seeing here. This is crazy. Absolutely crazy. I'm going to the mining deck. I hear that's where survivors are gathering. Jacob, I'll wait for you there. Unknown antigen injected into the filtration system. Nice. Damn it. The poison wasn't strong enough. It's still alive. Get in there and kill it before it contaminates the entire ship. I mean, I'm well equipped for that. Entering zero gravity. Eddie. Oh, damn. All right, I need a faster gun. What is going on here? Oh, 
Oh god. Out of ammo again. I'm gonna die. Oh. Oh. Alright, there I go. Okay, this whole sequence is extremely loud. Holy heck. Also, I am uh, in need of ammo like crazy for this part, apparently. Let me go buy a whole bunch of plasma here. Was not ready for the amount of ammo I was going to need for this part. I was not prepared at all. Holy heck. We just burned through everything we had there. All right, let me see about... Uh, you know what? The pulse rifle would actually be really good here, I think. But I just don't have it leveled up at all. Let me see about... Where is it? There we go. Okay, that should be good. Yeah, we got 50 rounds of it now, plus a bunch of line racks. All right, we should be a lot better off this time around, guys. I don't know why it was uh, not able to think about this before i forgot all about this part man got to figure out what i have to do at the end as well after i cut off all the tentacles what needs to happen from there what needs to happen from there let's figure this out shall we let's do this again
All right, it looks like I'm hurting it. It appears to be. Yeah, there we go. All right. Much easier when we have actual ammo, you know? <laughs> Isaac, you did it. Hammond, do you read? Oxygen levels are returning to normal. Hammond? Damn it. He's gone again. No sign of his rig anywhere. It's up to us now. I've got a plan to get off this ship. I've located an SOS beacon on the mining deck. If you can get down there and activate it, we might be able to send a distress call. Oh God, I don't know how much longer the dark will hold. So the main idea there uh, is it wanted us to throw explosives into its mouth hole, as well as we could use the things that it was throwing at us to kind of throw back at it. I just found it easier to just kind of shoot them, get them out of the way, and then shoot it directly in its weak spot. Like the little tongue thing in the middle of the mouth there. And so it worked out at the end of the day. Obviously, it worked out a lot better because I had actual ammo, but now we've burned through the majority of it. But what we're going to do now is just use a bunch of line racks as our main ammo for a while. The line gun is pretty good, and I'm pretty sure it won't have to fight anything like that for a while, so... We'll be able to build up ammo naturally again from there. Had to spend a little in order to get through that, but that's okay. It worked out for us. Now we need to move on to the next area, I'm pretty sure. I wonder how close I was to killing it in the first one, because I did hit it in the center a few times, but I was pretty unsure as to whether or not it was going to be something that I, like, I wasn't sure if I was actually damaging it. It was hard to tell. It was doing its like moan thing every time I hit it, but as far as actually doing the damage, I was unsure. But it worked out at the end of the day. Hey guys, do me a favor. If you've made it to this point in the video, leave a like on it so that way YouTube will recommend it to more like-minded folks. I would love to have your support on it and get as many people, uh, you know, involved in the content that I create as possible. It would mean a lot to me. I appreciate it, folks. And here we go to the next area. Let's do this. Chapter 6, Environmental Hazard Completed. Noise. Yeah, let's save. Yeah. I feel like we're making pretty fast progress through this game for a total of four hours of gameplay. Not quite four hours. I did have the game open for a little bit, but... This may be our last chance of getting out of here alive, Isaac. There's an asteroid loaded up in the mining bay waiting to be smelted. If you attach the SOS beacon to it, you can launch it away from the ship to make a clean broadcast. The beacon's on the maintenance subdeck. You can launch the asteroid from the control room. <sighs> Damn, the control room is locked. It looks like they keep an emergency access key on the processing subdeck. Couldn't be easy, could it? Nah. I don't know how much more of this I can take? I feel ya. Hey, power node, we take those. Gimme, gimme. Thank you. Thank you. There's a lot going on in here. All right. All right, there's a power bench. We just got a power node. There's a store here as well. Okay, so something was just crawling through the rafters there. Let me go ahead and check out this store before we upgrade anything. Maybe a new suit? Question mark? No. I'm pretty sure we'll have to find the uh, 
schematic for it. Don't think we'll be able to just kind of do it. Inventory. I have so many health packs. Let me sell a couple of these. Let me sell a few of these. Better way to say it. Let me move that. Got a ton of line racks. Let's put some flame fuel away. Force energy is good. We have three nodes. Let me go ahead and uh, let's buy a couple. We have five nodes. I think that's exactly what we need to cap off our uh, plasma cutter. I think it's exactly what I need here. Where's the bench at? Is done. That is maxed out. Very nice. Plasma cutter is an absolute monster now. All right, our next upgrades are probably going to go into. Hmm. I feel like I should change it up. I always do. I always do line gun whenever I play the game. Maybe this time I'll do something else. Maybe I'll upgrade like the pulse rifle. Pulse rifle could be used against a lot of other things in general. In fact, let me go get the pulse rifle. Let's get the old pulse rifle out, shall we? Change it up on myself here. We're going to keep the line gun on us just because we have a bunch of ammo. But I'm going to go ahead and put away the force gun. Do I have any ammo for it in here? No. I do not. Let's buy a couple magazines for it. It's on number four. All right. So now we have this bad boy. We can upgrade this and see how it goes. Let's make a save. Most of the time when I play through Dead Space, I always uh, go with a line gun. I, I feel like I should change it up this time around just to do something different. Line gun is like all reliable to me. That and the plasma cutter. Okay, so there's not friendly things down there? Okay, um, noted. The mining subject is offline for some reason, Isaac. I'll see if I can run a bypass. Okay. We are in preparation, yeah? Let's go processing. Up. Up. Yeah, you know, I, I saw something fall down from the roof and... Is nothing sacred. My elevator time is supposed to be sacred. All right, you guys just totally ruined the sacred elevator time. I'm supposed to be safe on elevators, damn it. I hear things on my left and my right. I'm trying to run pretty low on ammo there. Let's go back to the line gun. I should have used line gun on all of those guys. Hey, bro.
brother. Sir, that's illegal. I'm gonna have to ask you to knock that off. Why didn't I use the line gun on all of these guys? What is I What? What am I doing? Hey bud, you okay? He's fine, guys. He's fine, nothing to be concerned about. Everything's a okay. I right, wants me to go back that way. Let's check this way. Right. Kind of feeling a little bit like every time I like walk around, I like kick some some guy on the ground. I feel bad. Just kind of kicking happened? bodies around. I found Elizabeth, but there isn't a single space-worthy vessel in the whole goddamn bay. Jacob, hurry up! We need to find a beacon. There's gotta be one around here somewhere. All right, so we went full circle there. We need to go down that way. Let's go. Er, well, what is this path here? Does it just cut over to the other side completely? Yes. Just making sure. I like to make sure that I visually see everything so I can understand the mapping. Yeah, it sounds friendly out here. Nice high-pitched screeching. We're all friends out here, right? Except that guy, right? Guys? This guy's chilling outside the store. All right, we got anything cool in here? No? Damn. All right, maybe we'll find a schematic out this way. Generally speaking, a lot of the time when there's a store nearby, it means that we can find a schematic nearby. If it's not at the beginning of a level anyway. That's rang pretty true for me so far. Uh. There's a fail safe on the processing control door. It won't open until gravity is restored. But you can't turn on the gravity until those boulders are clear from the room. Maybe you can dump them into that gravity beam with your kinesis gun. So do you remember earlier in the game? Hold on, this guy's yelling at me. Stop that. Hey. You remember earlier in the game when I said that I like to put one point into uh, range on the Kinesis? It's paid off a lot, just that one point. It's paid off for me a lot in actually being able to reach things that are usually just outside of the basic level range. Hey, look at that. Look at that. We don't need the small boys here. Oh, damn it. Wait, what's this? Oh, it's nothing. Never mind. Yes, I hear you. Oh, dude, I keep picking up the med pack.
facility must be restored before accessing the control room. Thank you. All right, I think we uh, cleared everything, right? Yeah, we're looking good, man. All right, we're here. We need to go restore the gravity, which I believe is over there. Gravity must be restored before accessing the control room. Thank you. Gravity All right, what's what's this? All right. Apparently it's not going to let free the little guys based on that explosion. I'm telling you guys, the line gun is so good. It's so good. I've only got a few upgrades in it, and it just, it does fine, man. It does so well. Man, how much ammo do I have left for it? All right. All right. Let's go grab all the stuff over here. I feel like realistically I could have done all of this with the the pulse gun, but money. Wait, there we go. How's it going here, boys? How we doing? I think everyone's fine. We just caught them at nap time. I'll be quiet. That's the key, Isaac. It'll get you into the control room so you can launch the asteroid. Hey, be Don't quiet. They're sleeping. First. I read another report on the colonist dementia. It seemed to start after they removed the marker from the planet. God knows how long it was down there. Oh my god. Alright, let's use this for a while. We got plenty of ammo for it. We can burn through it. Here's an upgrade. Thank you. Thank you. Very good. Uh, did I not see that hatch break? Yeah. You're just going to break that and then not. All right. I'm a little terrified by this prospect. What was that? What are these noises, game? I'm on edge, shit, guys. I'm on edge. All 
right, I'm not gonna lie, that was actually terrible. It might be better if I just kind of use the uh, secondary grenades on it. I think it costs 10 per explosion, but that was actually terrible damage. Terrible damage. All right, we gotta go maintenance. All right, for this spot, we're going to use line gun in case some things more pop up on here. Yeah, I hear something. I don't like what I hear at all. It sounds like one of the big guys. Are we good? We are not good. Bad things are happening. Wait, what happened there? Okay, so I thought the secondary fire on it was uh, a grenade. Maybe I'm thinking of Dead Space 2, where that's a thing. The secondary fire is a grenade. I don't think I like the pulse rifle much, guys. Oh, my sensitivity. But you know what? I'll try uh, I'll try it out for a while anyway. Dr. Kai, what the hell are you doing? Any closer, and and I'll shoot him. Give me the access codes to the cargo bay. You idiot! This is processing. Why the hell would I have codes to cargo? Don't lie to me. I'm sick of everyone lying to me. It is imperative that I get the marker. Give me those codes. I don't have them. Is this what you did to the captain? Go on. Shoot me if you've got the balls. Idiot! It's the only way to stop it. The only way to end it. He's completely lost it. Somebody call security. <laughs> they don't trust the doctor, huh? I will drop that for the medium one. I also have a bunch of flamethrower ammo, so we're going to use this for a while. Man, I really did not like how the, uh, the pulse gun performed there. That was actually pretty terrible. I'm not going to lie to you guys. Oh, what the heck? Okay, that thing just randomly exploded on me because I walked too close to it. All right. All right. Well, we'll use that. That's fine. A little saddened by this. You don't look so good. All right. Now we save. The poor guy. All right, I don't think this is going to work out here. Let's switch to this. What is throwing it? Whatever's throwing it is up above. Can't do much about that from here, unfortunately. Hey, I'm going to borrow this. Hope you guys don't mind.
Hey, we gonna open up or? Isaac? Oh my God. Is that really you? It feels like it's been so long. But I can help you now. Come with me. And she's gone. We are hallucinating. We are hallucinators. All right, I definitely need all this plasma ammo for sure. I have so many health packs. What am I ever going to do with this many health packs? Let me just drop one, I guess. Okay. The game really is struggling to give me the things that I want right now. Does not stack items very well. Give me that. Give me those. Thank you. Don't say a word, Isaac. Don't say a word. Nope. Nope. another one I feel like that uh <laughs> that that uh, line gun round most definitely hit Nicole more than it did that necromorph Don't do it. You're fine. Everything's good. Let me just clean this mess up for you. Okay, the door's unlocked, Isaac. I can't get over to you, but I'll find a way. I was trying to clear a path for you, but. All right, it's fine. <laughs> Dude, so uh, the first one that jumped up on me here scared the hell out of me. I jumped so high, but the uh, the next one that popped up, I, I wasn't expecting, but it died instantly because it popped up right at the moment that I fired. So it didn't matter that it was there. So it just kind of keeled over as soon as it popped up here. That was That was pretty funny. Also, I most definitely shot Nicole in the back. I'm sorry about that. Um, I didn't intend to do that, but uh, that's what happened there. Isaac. Hey, I lost your signal for a while. You had me worried. Yeah. I see you've got the beacon, so head for the mining bay and attach it to the asteroid. I've been running trajectory calculations, and if we launch soon, there's a good chance the asteroid can reach a safe distance to begin transmitting. Yay. Still no sign of Hammond. In his state, I can't imagine he's still alive. I am having inventory struggles. Let me drop that. What is the schematic? Level four suit. I definitely, most definitely want that. And a power node. We take those. Thank you. Thank you. There's our level four suit schematic, guys. Hell yeah. I feel like we are not done, though. All right, we're going to pull this out for this area. Plasma cutter is really great in this spot just because it's faster. The rounds travel instantly.
Yoink. Hey, bud. I think we're good. Okay, so um, that explosive completely missed. It hit more more of me than it did them. Okay. I most definitely hurt myself more than I hurt my enemy there. You know what? Uh, they got me again. They got me again, guys. I thought that guy was dead. He was not dead. All right. So it looks like they did do end up doing a better job of making that happen later in the game. It was a security lockdown, although I don't think it helped them. Now that you've got the beacon and the key, head over there. Yeah, I'm gonna go to processing like first. The asteroid is held in place by some gravity tethers. You have to knock those out before you can launch it. I'm gonna go to processing first. I got some stuff to do at the store. You know what I mean? You know what I'm saying? I think everything's okay. I don't think anything's going to attack me here. We are good to go. All right, level four suits. Heck yeah. 35,000. Okay. I'll tell you what, um, I'm going to sell you a couple large med packs. How's that sound? Yeah, I knew you'd like that. Very good. Um, we need a hundred more. Let's just sell 10 flamer fuel, I guess. Level four suit is get. Let's see what we look like now. Oh, hell yeah. Very nice. We like that. All right. I have a hundred credits to my name. That can't be good. Hmm. Is there a gun I didn't buy? I didn't buy the contact gun, right? The contact beam? Yeah, I didn't buy that. All right. All right, I think we're good for now. But okay, this is a great spot to leave off, guys. We're going to go ahead and leave off here. We've been playing for over, uh, I mean, a, a a few hours tonight <laughs> i'm gonna go ahead and make a solid save here we got ourselves a level four suit i would love to keep playing but it's 5 a.m i should go to sleep thank you guys for hanging out with me today it was great pleasure to have you guys hanging out and watching my videos as always i i, I hope you guys continue to enjoy my dead space playthrough series here i'll be back again tomorrow with the next part and hope you guys are ready for it i think we're right around right around halfway through this game so far so we're making good progress, just kind of taking our time, looking at every little bit of everything that I can see without scouring every corner. Uh, I'm not looking 100% the game, like I said, but I am looking to just kind of play through the game and re-experience it all again before the remake does come out in January. 
so far it's been a blast i hope you guys have had a good time with me today thank you so much for leaving all your all of your likes on the on the video it means a heck of a lot to me and i will see you guys soon for more